Guys, thanks so much. What a great song, Carrie. And uh, this song is really about the presence of God and, and inviting God to come uh, into worship. And I know that's a big part uh, of just the songs you've written, and um, it's a big part of your heart uh, for the church is just to experience the presence of God. And talk about this song a little bit and just um, writing it and kind of what was the inspiration for you guys. Yeah. 
there's a lot of depth to this song. Um, I had had a dream about rain in a church. It was an ancient church, and I, in the dream, I walked in the back door, which was really the front door, but it was the back of the room. There were pews. It was a gorgeous, ornate room, and um, they just don't make churches like that very often anymore. It was gorgeous, and uh, it was raining inside this church, and there was like probably two to three um, inches of water on the floor, and it was pure and clean water. And I just felt like when I woke up, just this revelation of it that it was a purifying and a cleansing of the church and of the body of Christ. And then I began to think that's the heart of God. He wants to come back for a pure and spotless bride. So we're in a church, we're in an hour right now that I want us to pray and seek the face of God to say, God, purify us and make us ready for you to come. And so I brought this idea to Brooke and Scotty Lidgertwood, and Cody and I were there, and she was like, that's interesting, because I felt like I was supposed to bring you a song that I started years ago that um, just talks about rain. So she began to play the beginning of it and the, the oh, let it rain, and I started crying. I just was like, oh, my goodness, this is a God moment. This is definitely what we should write on. And so it took us a while to finish this song because we wanted to really make sure that we were saying everything we needed to say um, in reverence and, in, in, you know, this thing of just praying that the glory and the, the majesty of God would come and fill our churches again and, and just this heart cry for the rain and for the presence of God. You know, rain is indication of purity and of, of a refreshing of the spirit. And, and so um, just, it's just a prayer for, for the church, for the bride of Christ, not only to experience a, a glory falling, but for his glory and his holiness to truly come. We've got to come with clean hands and a pure heart. Mm -hmm. You know, it says, who can ascend the hill of the Lord? But he who has clean hands and a pure heart. So I pray that our churches would, would pray this and that a new revival and a fresh outpouring of his spirit mm -hmm. would fall on our churches. Wow, what a great word. <laughs> um, so Cody, kind of walk us through uh, what you're playing here. You're tuned to half step down, mm -hmm. is that right? Yep. And just kind of give us the chord progression. So it's an F sharp, so I'm playing in G, being mm -hmm. a half step down. Um, so it starts on a six minor, E minor shape mm -hmm. here to the four, to the one, to the five. And that's the whole verse. And then it shifts uh, to the chorus, which is a one. You hold it two bars, to the five, to the six, to the four. Same thing for the chorus. Uh, and then it goes to the bridge, and it goes back to that original uh, verse progression, the six, four, one, five. It's really just two progressions throughout the whole song. It's really yeah. easy to play. Yeah. And McKendry, you're playing, there's some parts in the beginning and also in the bridge yeah. section of the song. Kind of walk us through those. Okay, in uh, the intro, I'm just playing the six to the four to the one to the five. And I'm actually playing this little lick here. I'm going, so it's... That actually starts the intro and then it goes throughout the verse. And on the choruses, I'm just holding the one to the five to the six to the four. And then we, um, when we go to the bridge, there's a lake that goes, um, starts in the six minor. Guys, thanks so much for coming by and sharing the song with us. Really beautiful. It's a really special song. But you're